it looks like the New Testament is all about love, but the Old Testament is kind of scary and it's hard to find about love. Is there any love of God for people in the Old Testament? Exodus thirty three seventeen answers that question. Do you want to know more about it? Then stay tuned. Hello, welcome to 21st Century Moses channel. My name is Sam Ju. Let's go to the first section, exposition. Let's read Exodus 33, verse 17. And the Lord said to Moses, This very thing that you have spoken I will do, for you have found favor in my sight, and I know you by name. So we can see this is a conversation between God and Moses. And he said this very thing. What is this very thing? Now, in, in uh, previous verses, we see that the people of Israel were sinning against God. And God was about to destroy them. But Moses prayed for the people to intercede for them. So that, that is the prayer of Moses. So this very thing that you have spoken, Moses' prayer, I will do. Yes. And for you, Moses, have found favor in my sight okay and i know you moses by name of course god knows everyone's name but here we see the special affection special love for moses so we can see in this verse that most god loved moses um, in a very intimate way god knows and loves his servants in Exodus 3, God revealed his name to Moses, I am who I am. Throughout the book of Exodus, God showed several times the intimate relationship between God and Moses, his servants. How wonderful it would be if you also have that relationship with God. Christianity is not about keeping traditional rituals, but it is about relationship with God. Even if you go to the church and go do all the church activities, but if you do not have that intimate relationship with God, then those activities would be meaningless. Now, this is why Jesus came for. Jesus came not only to forgive your sins, but also to uh, restore the broken relationship with God and to reconcile us back to God. He came so that we, have, we would have the intimate relationship with God as Moses did. Therefore, seek to have intimate relationship with God through Jesus Christ more than any other relationships in the world. By the way, why is an intimate relationship with God so important, more important than keeping rituals? Share your thoughts in the comment section below. Remember keywords here, favor and name. So the main idea is Moses found the favor in God's sight and his name was known by God. Now, read this verse three times out loud. Pause the video. And recite this verse word by word. Pause the video, please. Okay, let's fill in the blanks and check it. And the Lord said to Moses, This very thing that you have spoken I will do, for you have found in my sight, and I know you by... Okay, the answers are favor, name, and today's verses, Exodus thirty-three seventeen. 17. All right, great job. You memorized eight verses. Make sure to put your own emoji on 365 empowerment checklist on the description section below. And if you think this video is helpful, please share this video with other people like your friends and family members. And if you have not, please click the like button, hit subscribe and click on the notification bell so that YouTube will show this video to more people in the world. Also watch day 57 video of a 70 days journey to the Bible. And please make sure to pray at least one hour after you read 17 chapters assigned for today. Prayer is so important. All right, that's it for today and looking forward to seeing you tomorrow.